In this video we're going to be editing a cabinet's outer and inner dimensions. So the starting point to calculating all the dimensions of a cabinet are the global outer dimensions. You can edit these from the dimensions section of the properties menu. First make sure you click outside the actual cabinet and then you will see these global dimensions height, width and depth displayed here. These can all be edited directly from here let's change the height to 900 and we can see that the models changed. You can also change the global outer dimensions by editing the inner dimensions. So those are the dimensions of any volume or zone inside your model. I'm going to click on the inner volume here. The dimensions are actually displayed here as well. That's because we've got view dimensions selected. So now that inner volume is selected you can see a different set of boxes in the properties menu. These are the inner dimensions which again you can edit. So if we change the height by 100 millimeters we'll see a change in the model again. Click outside and the outer dimension height has changed. I'm going to add an upright now to show you how we can edit just the volume to the right of it. Click on the inner volume and in the toolbar let's add an upright just click OK. Now this time I'm going to select just this inner volume, this zone. Here we can change the, let's change the width make it another 200 millimeters wide. So the only thing that's changed, the, um, the upright hasn't actually moved but the overall dimensions of the cabinet or model have changed. Please note you can move the upright itself by clicking on it and then uh, using this section of the properties menu to do with position. You can change the positions here. We cover this in a separate video. Whilst we're looking at this panel there's an important point to make about the free or demo version of Polyboard. If you have an activated version of Polyboard you'll see the panel's dimensions in this section here. You can see that they're actually slightly greyed out. This is because these are not editable. They are just for information. It's manufacturing information that inputs to the cut list so you can build your project. In the demo mode, as you'll see from the image that's coming up on the video now, these values don't appear. So you just want to stress that they're not there to edit your cabinet. In the free or demo version of Polyboard you can still design in full. These dimensions are always calculated from the outside dimensions which you have access to in the free version. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.